about Marilyn Monroe. When we, we did one picture in which she had a bit, she got $100 for one day's work. You can imagine uh, how long ago this was. And uh, Lester Cowan, who was producing the picture, he called me up because I was going to do the scene with Marilyn. He called me up and he said, I wish you'd come over to the studio tomorrow to my office because we're going to try out three girls with a part in, uh, in this picture. I think it was called Love Happy or something. A terrible picture. So uh, I sat there with Lester and uh, the three girls were there. I was introduced to them. And he says, now the first girl, walk. And she walked across from one end to the other. This is very nice. This is now the second girl walk, and she did it too. And then he, the third one. He says, now you walk across. And he says, well, which one uh, do you like the best? I says, you're kidding, aren't you? Now, how can you take anybody except that last girl? Well, the whole room revolved when she walked. Listen. And it was Marilyn Monroe. Yeah. And she got $100. And then we quit shooting at 5 and she got $25 extra for going to a couple of gas stations. They were plugging some kind of gas or something, which was part of the picture or something. And she got $25 extra for, they took snapshots of her from 6 to 8 o'clock. She's a wonderful girl, really. She's a very nice girl. This will never do. I got to hide like an elephant. By the way, did you ever try to hide an elephant? You will be dead in five minutes. <laughs> For your information, my doctor gave me three years to live, and I don't intend to make a fool out of him. Come in. Is there anything I can do for you? What a ridiculous statement. Mr. Grenion, I want you to help me. I have a little sand left. What seems to be the trouble? Some men are following me. Really? I can't understand why. I advise you to leave. I'll take you down to the bus station. Oh, uh, if I'm not back tonight, go ahead without me. That's been the history of all my romances. <laughs> 